Hello everybody. In this video, we're going to set up the next gen editor. We're going to make this one. Let's get started with this. I'm going to take a photo of this plant to put into the display. Let's take this one. I'm using this FTDI. You can use any uh, USB to TTL converter. The driver software for this one is in the description below. The wiring connection is here, like this. Let's zoom in to see the wiring properly. We need to download the Nextian editor first. Go to any web browser, type Nextian editor. Ah, the, this is the one. I give you the link in the description below also. Uh, so we can download exe or zip. I downloaded the exe already. So we go to the uh, download folder. This is the one and double click. Next. It's very simple. Uh, I will fast forward most of the part. Uh, download and install this feature. Click close. We can minimize this. The editor is installed. It took me around uh, 15 minutes. Now we can open the editor. I can click file, new, uh, give a name. I give uh, video and click save my next editor code is this one so i'm going to use this one uh, this is the one i'm using so click this one okay okay for the direction i'm going to use this side okay now i'm going to make a background image for that you can use any image editor i'm going to use the simple one the windows paint uh, go to the paint to use this one uh, the size is here so we ch change this to uh, resize is to uh, 240 320 so i'm going to make this side 320 for that i'm going to zoom in first edit view zoom in the control page up so this way it's easier so this side i'm going to make it to uh, 320 320 yeah this side I'm going to make it to 240 so it's 240 320 now we can say save, save uh, IMG save so I'm going to take the picture the one I took open so this is the picture so the size is very big so i'm going to resize it to around 10 percent and okay and i'm going to uh, select and take the image whatever size i needed so i'm going to take from here to here uh, it's a two this much size and uh, copy And we go to the file, the one we have, the, this one, so we paste it here. So this is the picture I have and uh, zoom in. And uh, we can draw anything, so for example, we can draw a star or something here. And uh, we can take different colors and put it there and uh, we can have a um, 
something like hello world we can do anything you just uh, play around um, so and we can save now we go to next in editor and uh, to add the picture we can click this button and uh, go to the folder and uh, this is the one click ok ok now we click this one so the picture is here and we go to the properties and uh, here browse and uh, this is the one click ok so the picture is here uh, now if you want to put uh, anything else we can put it in the next video we do one by one uh, today I just put uh, the scrolling text only so I put it here now so for that uh, we need uh, we need to add to the font also so we, we have to create font tools font generator and uh, we make it big bigger like uh, 32 or something generate font uh, your font name uh, F generate font save Done. add font yes now we can close now for this one uh, if you want to change the sliding text uh, we go to the properties here uh, and the text is here Se select and delete this one and put um, um, welcome or something click ok um, now we can save if you want to compile we can compile and see there's no error and we can click the debug button and see the thing in the uh, how it uh, how it uh, download to the next gen editor uh, all looks good uh, now we can close uh, now we can upload the code uh, click this button and uh, select the com port and go it's done I have uploaded the code. It is here. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any question, write down in the comment section below. I try to answer as much as I can. Thank you. Bye.